Thank you all. Um, incredible honor to be here with you today. Um, as everybody knows, we've got an incredible opportunity to take back our democracy with what's happened with the implosion of the two political parties. Um, we've lived now for almost 70 years with basically a war economy uh, my entire life. Um, a lot of these issues I know many of you have probably been working at for a lot longer before I was even conscious of many of these issues. Uh, unfortunately, when I was a young person, um, I thought I was informing myself by reading the newspaper and reading the magazines and listening to the radio and watching the news. I thought that made me an informed citizen. Um, I know now that probably had I been totally ignorant, it would have been better than being as misinformed as I was. Um, I've moved uh, to the Adirondack Park in 1988. Um, I did have the privilege of growing up in a time where um, at least education was affordable. Um, I went to a land-grant university, um, ended up going to right to work for corporate America, had it pretty good, um, believed in the American dream because I kind of fell into it. Well, uh, many people were falling off the edge, um, but I was uh, increasingly aware I didn't like my wages going for war and for incarceration. And there was really no political alternative through either of the two major political parties. Um, occasionally, we'd get a progressive candidate um, come along, but we all know what happened. Um, so this grassroots work that's been done is incredibly exciting. Um, but if you look at what's going on underground, um, we still have these incredible amounts of money flowing into our communities. Um, in some sort of Orwellian fashion. We've got a government that's at war in Afghanistan. We've got unprecedented amounts of opiates coming in. How's it getting here? And yet that same government that seems to be letting those drugs in here and having synthetic opioids being prescribed to everyone, um, they're providing grants to communities um, to combat this. Um, this is crazy. Just think if this money was directed properly, what we could do to rebuild our communities. My campaign certainly um, rests on the four pillars of the Green Party. Peace, social justice, grassroots democracy, and ecological wisdom. And that's something we're not going to get, we haven't gotten, and we're not going to get from the two political parties. Um, So anyway, uh, I really appreciate uh, the opportunity to serve you. I'm looking forward to a green presidency, some greens in Congress, greens in the Assembly, and greens in the Senate. And uh, we're going to change things. Thanks very much.